ban kham pun suk ya kalai kawan jong bi pai ba ka any rate kawan ra sha phi ya ka app thamai ka ba phila ban download na play store ka ba ka tang ka any rate rider ha ka ni ka ki don bon cha ki kali ba phila ban jet kat kum ka jing kwa jong phi kum ka bike ne scooty ka auto rickshaw taxi ka mai bat ka tourist taxi ka ba phila ban le chadu ko hati airport Pila ban puk ning ba kini ka app pam tang ha shilong han rei ha baro ki district na benda ka jing te pakham pania phone hau ni number 8416069241 namar minyo kor ya ka kor jong phi pentip menteri rang ba aduk ke jela mikhalayao konrad ke sangma lang ba kilat pathai khobor ba ka so ka jela kan pei tingka hadu si ha cha klor na ka banta ban kin tewi ka kam yele ka football ha po ka jela da ka pasna pan ba su su ya ki cha ka yele ka lang ba ka local football club sport scheme na ka banta ki club ki ba ha ka jela hi pro ko wei menteri rang ba ha ba kren si kilat pathai khobor ha ka atrik naila rajab sao lokadau ba kumba ar spa nyu pesan teli ki Caka ya leka itu mai kira ngdo na padeng ke jingsna habro ke leng ke jala na ke bapenti pru ke bakasor ke jala shen hi kan sepli saya ke mission football tu pat ban yo ban kenti ulem ya ke football ya ke kerdan ke bakam hapo da ke basna ke basis pak ke wui teli ke grassroot center hapo ke jala ha ke balakum nu kum nu pra hajar ngur ke kena ke nyo ban shahi kai ha ke shis nem shushu lo ong ru bakaloka football club support scheme umentri reng pak ulo ong bakane ke scheme kan ai jingirap kumpal lai klub tingka na ke bentaki klub ki bakam he lani ilai klub berkhasan lak tingka na ke bentaki klub ki bakam red ki bedon hapo jong ke jela mi khlaya hi pro kawai the football uh, mission program at the grassroots level uh, we plan to expand that uh, much much more aggressively in the future so that uh, more uh, uh, youngsters can get an opportunity to get trained uh, get professional help and uh, professional support uh, at the rural level also and uh, that we hope will then produce many many more talented footballers and allow them to come into the mainstream uh, football uh, scenario at the national as well as hopefully the international level also uh, so that's the first most important thing i would like to share with you the second most important thing i would like to share with you is that um, the uh, government has also decided that uh, we need to support our different clubs at different levels and therefore uh, uh, we are going to start a special program where uh, under the government we are going to support different clubs in terms of financial uh, uh, support and we're starting with football and as we move along hopefully in other sports and disciplines also it will happen uh, so we have uh, two categories where we're going to support local clubs. Uh, the first one is what we call the elite clubs, which is the I-League uh, and, uh, uh, and above. Uh, those, uh, uh, those clubs that make it to the I-League and above, the government will support them with a grant of two crores and uh, an additional one crore uh, through sponsorship. So two plus three plus one. Uh, this is a fund that we are giving to Uh, to support and to motivate clubs that uh, are doing well. So this fund will be given to uh, the clubs that are able to make it to the elite club, which is the I-League uh, and above uh, tournaments that are there at the national level. So there are of course very few clubs right now in Meghalaya that make it, but we're hoping that with this incentive that we plan to give, which is two crores plus another one crore through sponsorship, two crores from the state government, We are hoping that this would be a motivation for other clubs to start uh, doing better and performing better in the future. Uh, while we do that, we also realize that there are many clubs at the grassroots level which may not have that kind of talent and uh, uh, exposure yet to be at the elite club. So based on different uh, criteria and categories, we will work out more details on this. But we do plan to come out with uh, what we call the grassroots and the intermediate clubs. Uh, so we plan to support them up to 15 lakhs to these clubs also, which can be in any part of the state. And uh, we will come up with certain criteria. Uh, again, this is being done to promote and to support uh, football. Uh, no, 1000 crores worth of projects is ongoing. So we have about 275 infrastructures, including this, including the 120 or 130 crores of indoor facility going on just behind this particular uh, structure 
including the two phases of the PS Sangma Stadium. So first phase, the football part is over, but the uh, indoor stadium is still going on. The wild jet has been completed. So like that, uh, just Honorable Minister has just recently invested uh, or you know uh, uh, announced and tendered out uh, close to about seven, eight uh, artificial turf uh, uh, things. There are some swimming pools being built up. So stuff like that. So we have got multiple projects going on.